go. Welcome everyone to the final match of the PBO regular season in Stargaze. I'm here with Orin. Say hello. Hola. And Jerry, he'll say hello. How's it going? And we're here to see Void versus Don for all for everything. Pittsburgh just Boy has to win JK. more than 1-0. That's all he has to do. Oh boy. That's huge. He just has to win. This is not a good lead. You have to admit, Boy must be so nervous. Pittsburgh must be so nervous right no, now. No, he has plot armor. He doesn't get nervous. Oh, This is true. He must true. always be at the he, very bottom of he the is, He team. is undefeated. I think 2-3. Two, was it 2-3? He joined season two, season six, so five seasons he's been with us. He's I'm pretty wow. sure he's been in the playoffs every time. Oh, he no. he is five and zero in week eight games. Maybe three and zero when they're meant for playoffs. There's a first time for everything. This could get real interesting real quick. Yeah, I hurt Ladios. This is not what you want to see off the rip. And the I fact didn't... wait, the Comfey is back. I don't think we've seen it since week here. one. I don't the think Comfey we've seen it since week back. one. Is it a Terra Comfey? Oh, yeah. this could be a setup opportunity right here, right now. This could be very, very fun. We do have a full health register, though, so I think... JK would never up set right up. right now is a little bit too early. <laughs> Maybe we can go for an aggressive... I don't know. I think just an Iron Head here is fine, believe it or not. I think you want to gauge damage on the register. You don't want to set up too early in case we see a red card or something like that. <laughs> When's the last time yeah. you saw a red card? Uh, a couple days ago, actually. So, I was watching soccer earlier, and I saw one earlier. Oh shit, that would make sense. You know, I would really like to see the forever room click uh, shift gear and then high horsepower into the registeel. The, the everything. Dang it! It just feels too early. To not, pop. Not, so not everything. Could still get the parting shut off here too if that's what we're. I going mean, to does do. I what? what? Room. I mean, I guess. I mean, we go rotom heat here. Spike. We go U turn. If they think it's U turn, we go U turn rotom heat, right? I don't think it's a U turn from the Comfey from the Ladios. Does it get U turn? No, and it's also choice lock soaring. It outspeds the grenade. It's choice. choice it is currently yeah. choice into a Draco Meteor at minus two in front of a still type that can set up. So it's a big problem. Or well. So we go instant Rotom Heat. It's definitely causing some concern. We go Rotom Heat. We could see Blastoise. We could definitely see Blastoise coming Blastoise in. Blastoise is a possibility. It depends how much shift you wanted to take because you need you need something to handle the Great Tusk now. The Latios is no longer at high enough health to naturally take two hits from the Tusk. Or even one hit for that matter. Point. What it goes it, for. It's Fizz Death Rotom with Will O' Wisp, probably. I don't know. That'd be right. Um, or we go Registeel and counter play somehow. Registeel is a more defensive option. I, Judging by how long into the Void, I assume it's, it's, it's Pittsburgh who's taking a while here. I'm guessing that this was not a scenario he had in mind. I agree. Um, I, feel like, I feel like he wanted. The Latias lead against the Greninja the lead. Steel. Oh, this All is right. the shift gear. So what's going to happen now? Is this, this a shift gear again? Is this a substitute? Is this a thunder wave from the Registeel? Is this an earthquake from the Registeel? Can the Registeel even touch this? I don't know. Oh, seismic toss Registeel. Seismic toss wouldn't be doing a nearly enough damage to threaten this oh. out. But we're going to go ahead and scout for thunder wave. Body press. I don't hate that. It's body defense. Oh. oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, mm. uh, answer neither. Reggie Steel uh, historically bulky. Probably is the appropriate answer here. The thing is with this is that it's going to raise the base power of Iron Defense. Right out into this, that is fine. Set up Comfey. Here we go, baby. CM Comfey. Let's see it. I do not remember if Comfey has access to Taunt. I believe it does. If it does, it should go for it. Oh, here. what a double! That's a nice double right there. Wow. Um, and the thing is, the overheat resist is Crocolore. So you can go into Crocolore if you want. I'm worried about what's coming in on a Volt Switch here. I think going Tusk is way too aggressive, especially on an obvious overheat. He could just Wisp it. 
here comes Crocolord. This yeah, is gonna yeah. be the whisk. Okay. This is that's a okay. that's a much much safer play. He needs rocks. But here up. comes a Thunderbolt. He's, Gets he's it. going to challenge if the Crocolord can even Snarl. do anything to him. Oh my god. It's just, wow. It's eject pack. Probably meant to be paired with the overheat. But this is not good. This is not good if you're JK, because now you have a paralyzed Crocolore in front of what is assumed to be a very massive threat in the Ogidogi. But we can't set up. We can try. Um, To be honest, we can try. Um, uh, would you? I feel like we're going to... It's a possibility. Right. Uh, I now think there's going to be a Corviknight. I'm going with Corviknight here. I think Corviknight's the switch. I, don't, I think if this thing cooks bulk up Corviknight, you're just getting cooked. But at the same time, clicking bulk up in front of the Crocolor is a bit of a play right now. So I think going for damage is probably a good idea. He's got it. In that case, I think Corviknight is fine. I He's... also think Great Tusk is a fantastic, is a good switch into this, though. So it's a possibility as well. We see this thing go for like a poison move and hoping that it'll be able to get knocked off. Poison? We get the poison. Oh my All god. Right. Plot so armor. It's not the most value you can get, but it's definitely nerve-wracking right now if you're watching this uh, and, and your name is uh, Kurt. But he could be world. determining what the best mid-ground is. If it's not headlong, it's probably knockoff, so he at least guarantees get some value out of the turn, so he can get rid of an item on what could be a defensive blast switch switching the Rotom coming back in, so he's guaranteeing a little bit of damage instead of nothing with headlong. If this thing stays in, he gets rid of an item. If the Latias comes in, he kills it. So right. I think knockoff exactly. is his best play here. He could potentially also go for Stealth Rock, depending on... A CC straight uh -oh. up! And we do stay in. How much is this going to do? Counter? Oh, shit. <laughs> may, this may be... If he's willing to do that, there's probably a Shuckaberry, which is yep. crazy to think about. Here comes the Latios here. Oh, my nice God. Play. He literally Very has well Plot played. Armor, dude. You can't it's... really lock yourself into a Psychic... You can't lock yourself into a move here, though, which is the problem. Because something immediately comes in and grabs that momentum back. Or a sphere happens. That's fine. I it's think the most, the most neutral part. The problem play, is yeah. now it's letting in this Latios. What is your response going to be? Oh, because uh, now you've given this thing a free turn. And he knows you can switch out. Because if you don't switch out, he can take full advantage of you. Whether that be through Calm Mind, Agility, Dragon Dance. Could be a million other things. This Comfey also Comfe, probably can't sure. one-shot this. But it can it probably all speeds and goes for draining kiss with trio yeah it's just draining kisses it to death it's how much are they going to do to each other not much because well, well, is a very innovative in. pokemon you can do a lot of different things this is not a switch in uh you better you better this have this is not good you better um, have the best move pittsburgh better be ready to your, what it really good call which would, it, would hit which would hit the Comfy on the physical side instead of the special side that it's boosting up on, therefore it would win the common 1v1. Would it would it have side shock though? It does have luster purge. That did nothing. Get a freeze. That did nothing. That did oh no. No uh -oh. drop there is a little annoying. Oh a drop there is annoying. Is this gonna be a recover? Uh, I don't think we can kill this. Does he not have the comfort? We've seen two moves. Okay, so this is going to be... Do we hit Draco Meteor? Draco! Does he even kill from here? Yeah, he kills. Does he even kill from here? If yeah. you're JK, do you preserve this as well and go hard Corviknight? Oh my god, yeah. Turn, and then you bring this back in later and it's already proven it can be a demon. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's what he does. He doesn't play around with the it. The Corv... Draco! No, right. of course. It's a crit. Can click U-turn here for free, and then can bring the Latios right back in. Into the Comfey. Into the Comfey, which is... Now it's a little scarier, because crits and... Huh? Huh? That's okay. Yeah, this is fine. Um, oh, okay. This could be physical. I'll go for a low kick. Uh, I am a little worried about it, this. It doesn't have a low kick. Oh my god! <laughs> That does nothing, however, and that will be dead. And now you're gonna just gone. However, it's notable now that this thing is much lower than it was. So if you let this take dam any more damage, any more damage, this thing's probably in range of Revit Room at this point. Oh boy, here we are. 
So we have to watch plus two Revivroom into the rest, especially since the Ogadilly is now chipped as well. So here we're, comes this. We're just going to chip this down? With, that's what we're going to do. Keeping in mind, this is unaware. So, um, it's a great question. I mean, I yeah, think that's, that's what is, isn't for. that, doesn't it work like that amongst? There may have been something here that is here that, oh, nice Volt. Excellent Volt. We get advantage now. That's, that's Latias or Comfe. Who wants to take another Draco? We're going to find out. It's probably going to be the Corviknight, who's probably going to mm, roost this one off. That's a really gonna... important chip on Corviknight. <laughs> it's important, but for the most part, it's going to be able to get rid of it, especially if it has the body press. We don't. We haven't seen any moves from it yet, so I'm going to assume roost is one of them. Could be body press to help with the Registeel, which is what I think it will be. If it's on a Brave Bird, then it's a hard throw, I'm going to say. I'm going to assume that thing has the body press until further notice. Registeel so could have recover. Registeel could have recover. It does not learn recover. It sorry. does it? Are you sure? It does not. It learns rest. That's what it is. But since we've seen an item, we haven't seen an item. The other R recovery be, move. It could be rest. It missed oh, the Draco. That's not, that's not good. He stayed in the madman. The madman just stayed in. Missed the Draco. Oh, that's not good. But we do have Comfey, so I don't think all is lost here. It's He, st he stayed in. But Comfey set up Comfey, um, baby. Terra Comfey also. Might be Terra Fire. Probably won't tear it in front of this. Could if they wanted to, I guess. We're going to make an aggressive double here. Ooh, oh, did it work? Oh, no. Pittsburgh trying to get I cute. I see what's going on. Because if the Comfey kills the Latios without thought of setup, then the Rev Room comes in for free. So I see what he's doing. It's just that this is not working very well i i don't think uh, pittsburgh has picked up on this so it's looking like he's playing overly aggressive he's behind so he's be making a couple plays yeah but jk is is pretty dead set in what he wants to do here this is a rev of room end game if i have ever seen it and that's why we have so oh, we're gonna no, sign we're Yogi just, Yogi here that's that's uh, that's good. a play that's and a play. Now we know he's gonna play it safe and kill the Lottie, and he does. He just he can't win 1-0. He doesn't make it if he wins 1-0. He needs to win 2-0. Yeah. Gonna come down. I think it's gonna come down to Comfey versus Revivroom. Here's the Revivroom. Oh room. my god. This is a shift gear, ladies and gentlemen. What what if Comfey call my Terror Blast thoughts? It won't out it won't outspeed. It will die, I think. So Even what? if it were Terra into fire, if it goes for gunk shot. Yeah, we still don't know the other moves on River Room. Like I said, it could have high horsepower. It no. probably does. Oh or my god, yeah, high horsepower. If it's a Terra typing, it's a possibility as well that oh it could my just god. Terra blast a Registeel. Oh. So this is just a matter of what happens now. Like, this is not good. There's also a possibility as well. The Corviknight has pressure, and I don't think that the company does not have terrible ass. And this could be really rough. A Comfey into two steel types, a fire type with unaware, and the access to roar. And presumably, you know, recovery still has its E light intact. Like, that's not good. So we're going to double into Registeel here on the Terra Water, on the shift gear. Oh, this could very well have something. Uh oh, here it is. I think this is it. I think it's over. Yeah, I think it's it. over. Yeah. I, yeah, it's done. It's done and dusted. Unless this Comfey is willing to do no, some shit. No, he outspeeds Terra Blast. It has Terra Blast. The plot armor is gone. The plot armor is gone, and Kurthwak makes the playoff. It's Terra Poison. Oh, he showed it off for the people. Pittsburgh. We salute you, JK. I forget what this does for you, but we'll find out very soon. It probably it might keep him out of relegation. We're going to find out. Yes?